He is known for his contributions in a wide range of fields, making him a French polymath. He is recognized for his work on Mersenne prime numbers and Mersenne's laws, which revolutionized mathematics and the understanding of vibrating strings. He is Marin Mersenne, the renowned philosopher and mathematician. In the bustling intellectual landscape of the 17th century, one man stood at the crossroads of science, mathematics, and philosophy. Marin Mersenne, a French polymath and ordained Catholic priest, became a beacon of knowledge and innovation during his time. His insatiable curiosity and ability to make connections between people and ideas earned him the title, the Postbox of Europe. Mersenne's contributions spanned a wide range of fields. Mathematicians recognize him for his exploration of Mersenne prime numbers, a class of numbers that fascinated him. These prime numbers, expressed as mn equals 2n minus 1, continue to captivate mathematicians to this day. But Mersenne's genius extended beyond mathematics. He delved into the realm of acoustics, formulating Mersenne's laws that shed light on the harmonics of vibrating strings. His groundbreaking work on music theory, known as Harmony Universelle, earned him the moniker, the father of acoustics. However, Mersenne's impact was not limited to the confines of academia. With his vast network of contacts in the scientific world, he became the epicenter of scientific and mathematical discourse during the first half of the 1600s. His ability to bridge gaps between scholars and ideas made him a crucial figure in the exchange of knowledge throughout Europe. Mersenne's brilliance was not confined to the realm of science, he was also deeply rooted in theology and philosophy, writing and lecturing on these subjects as a member of the Minim religious order. Join us as we delve into the life and legacy of Marin Mersenne, a man whose intellectual pursuits knew no bounds. Discover how his unwavering thirst for knowledge and his ability to connect people and ideas left an indelible mark on the history of science and philosophy. Marin Mersenne, a French philosopher and mathematician, was a man of great intellect and influence. Born into a peasant family in the county of Maine, Mersenne's thirst for knowledge led him on a remarkable journey of discovery in collaboration with some of the greatest minds of his time. After joining the Minim Friars and pursuing theological studies, Mersenne found himself in the company of like-minded individuals such as René Descartes, Galileo Galilei, and Pierre Petit. His insatiable curiosity drove him to correspond with scholars from all over Europe, including Giovanni Doni, Jacques Alexander Le Tenor, and Constantin Huygens. Mersenne's dedication to learning and his role as a staunch defender of Galileo earned him the respect and admiration of his peers. In 1635, Mersenne established the Académie Parisienne, a gathering place for astronomers, philosophers, and mathematicians. This informal academy, with nearly 140 correspondents, paved the way for the later establishment of the prestigious Academy des Sciences. Mersenne's commitment to fostering intellectual discourse often led to disputes among his learned friends, including notable conflicts between Descartes and Pierre de Fermat. His efforts in cultivating a community of scholars laid the groundwork for the future development of scientific societies such as the Royal Society in London. Despite his vast network of correspondence and intellectual pursuits, Mersenne remained humble and open-minded. He met with renowned philosopher Tommaso Campanella, recognizing his imagination and memory but concluding that he could not offer much in terms of scientific teachings. Mersenne's interactions with Campanella and other philosophers from different backgrounds helped shape his own philosophical outlook. Mersenne's numerous visits to Italy and correspondence with thinkers like March and Ruhr further enriched his understanding of scientific ideas, particularly the Copernican model proposed by Pierre Gassendi. His contributions to the field of mathematics and his engagement with prominent figures like Descartes and Galileo solidified his place in history. Marin Mersenne's philosophy and approach to knowledge continue to inspire us today. His dedication to collaboration and intellectual exchange reminds us of the power of collective wisdom. Mersenne's ability to bridge the gap between diverse perspectives encourages us to embrace different viewpoints and challenge our own beliefs. As we navigate the complexities of daily life, we can draw upon Mersenne's example to seek out the truth, engage in critical thinking, and foster a spirit of curiosity and open-mindedness. Marin Mersenne, a renowned philosopher and mathematician of the 17th century, made significant contributions to various fields of knowledge. One of his most influential works, Question Celebrimi in Jean Sim, was a commentary on the Book of Genesis. While it may appear as a collection of treatises on different topics, the underlying theme was a polemic against magical and divinatory arts, Kabbalism, and pantheistic philosophies. Mersenne strongly condemned astral magic, astrology, and the concept of anima mundi. His criticism extended to prominent figures like Marsilio Ficino, Pico della Mirandola, and Robert Flood. Mersenne's Harmony Universelle is perhaps his most renowned work, particularly in the field of music theory. 
It provided a comprehensive understanding of musical concepts and explored the mathematical relationships involved in music. Mersenne formulated what is now known as Mersenne's Laws, which described the frequency of oscillation of a stretched string. This work also introduced innovative concepts that laid the foundation for modern reflecting telescopes, although Mersenne himself did not attempt to build one. Despite his contributions to mathematics and science, Mersenne's impact extended beyond these domains. He played a crucial role as a network hub for scholars, fostering the exchange of information through extensive correspondence with mathematicians and scientists from different countries. His association with mathematician and philosopher René Descartes allowed him to cultivate an international network of intellectuals, leveraging his legal acumen and ties to the print world. Mersenne's philosophical works showcased his wide scholarship and unwavering theological orthodoxy. He defended Descartes' ideas with great enthusiasm and even submitted a manuscript copy of Descartes' Meditations on First Philosophy to eminent Parisian thinkers. Mersenne's defense of Descartes' orthodoxy against numerous clerical critics solidified his contribution to philosophy. As we reflect on Marin Mersenne's life and work, we can draw inspiration from his dedication to intellectual pursuits and his unwavering commitment to defending ideas he believed in. Mersenne's emphasis on rationality, critical thinking, and scholarly exchange can guide us in navigating the complexities of our daily lives. By embracing a similar spirit of open-mindedness and intellectual curiosity, we can continue to expand our knowledge and contribute to the advancement of learning in our own unique ways. Marin Mersenne, a renowned philosopher and mathematician of the 17th century, found himself embroiled in a battle against the spread of occult and mystical thinkers. During this time, two German pamphlets known as Fama Fraternitatis and Confessio Fraternitatis were circulating throughout Europe, claiming to be manifestos of a secret society called the Brotherhood of Rosicrucians. These pamphlets, written by a small group knowledgeable about the sciences of the day, aimed to promote educational reform and establish a new form of scientific religion. Mersenne, however, led the fight against the acceptance of these ideas. He particularly opposed the views of Robert Flood, a prominent promoter of Rosicrucianism who engaged in a lifelong battle of words with Johannes Kepler. While many scholars defended the Rosicrucian ideas and claimed to be members of the Brotherhood, historians now agree that there is no evidence of its existence at the time. Later Rosicrucian orders borrowed the name but had no connection to the original writers of the Rosicrucian manifestos. In the midst of this controversy, Mersenne underwent a transformation in his own philosophical approach. In the mid-1630s, he abandoned the search for physical causes in the Aristotelian sense and instead embraced the ideas put forth by Galileo Galilei. Mersenne, who had been in correspondence with Galileo, recognized the importance of descriptive science of motions rather than seeking underlying causes. He extended the work on vibrating strings originally developed by Galileo's father, Vincenzo Galilei. Mersenne's battles with occult and mystical thinkers not only showcased his intellectual rigor but also highlighted the need for critical thinking and discernment in the face of unfounded beliefs. His commitment to empirical science and rejection of pseudoscience paved the way for a more rational and evidence-based approach to understanding the world. Mersenne's philosophy serves as a reminder to question and scrutinize ideas that lack solid foundations, empowering us to navigate the complexities of daily life with reason and clarity. Do you want to explore more philosophers? Who do you want to see featured next? Subscribe and leave a comment below to let me know. I'll see you in the next video.